I'm Nick at 4 Motorsport, and today we're going to go over the PCV system found on Audi EA839 V6 engines, their weak points, and the innovative 034 Motorsport products that we have developed to solve the problems that occur when they fail. First, let's talk about the PCV system, what that means, and what it does. PCV stands for Positive Crankcase Ventilation, and it's a system installed onto the engine to make sure that the crankcase is under constant vacuum in all forms of operation of the engine. The PCV system gathers vacuum to evacuate any crankcase case pressure via two areas. The first is from the charge pipe system when under light load, idle, or general cruising around. The second is when under full boost, it utilizes vacuum that's created at the front of the turbocharger in the turbo inlet. The system that decides between those two vacuum sources are a series of check valves installed here and here that open and close depending on the driving situation that you are in. The factory PCV system, by and large, is effective at regulating crankcase pressure. However, it has one critical weakness in the check valve system installed on the PCV breather hose. Namely, the check valve that connects to the charge pressure side on the charge pipe to the PCV block. Over time, the check valve that prevents boost pressure from entering into the engine and crankcase weakens and actually fails entirely, allowing for full boost pressure when under wide open throttle to enter into the PCV and into the crankcase. First, you may notice oil pooled around the opening of the oil cap or even out between the PCV block and the cylinder head itself. In some instances, the pressure pushing up behind the oil cap can actually eject the factory oil cap from the PCV block, allowing oil to spew all around in the engine bay and potentially on hot surfaces like the exhaust. We ourselves experienced an oil cap ejection due to a PCV failure on one of our in-house development vehicles, which ultimately led to us finding the critical problems within the PCV system and developing our upgraded PCV products that we'll go over here in a minute. The oil cap ejection that we experienced in-house also highlighted a secondary issue with the oil cap, which is that it does not have a positive interlock or a strong connection with the PCV block on the EA839. 034 Motorsport engineers solved that problem with the development of the 034 Motorsport billet oil cap specifically for the B9 EA839 engines, which utilizes a very strong retention clip that positively interlocks into the PCV breather block. Audi is actually aware of this failure point in their PCV breather hose, so much so that they issued a TSB noting the issue and stating a revised product that allegedly solves the problem. In our testing at 034 Motorsport, we found their revision to still fail under some circumstances. So ultimately, the factory has not provided an adequate solution to prevent this potentially catastrophic failure. Determining if your PCV breather hose has failed or not is actually quite simple. The process is to remove the PCV hose from your car and blow into the positive pressure side to determine if the check valve is functioning or has failed. For a demonstration here, I have a intact OEM PCV breather hose and a failed breather hose. And you'll see the difference between the two as I test them. So as I said, you take the small side, you blow in, and it holds pressure. The check valve is closed and does not allow any of the pressure I'm attempting to push through to come out. When we switch over to one that has experienced a failure, you'll find The same blowing through allows the air to simply pass through, which effectively means that this would allow boost pressure directly into your engine, causing potentially all the symptoms we just discussed. Instead of waiting for Audi to come up with a solution, the talented engineers at 034 Motorsport spent years developing a bulletproof solution that accurately solves the problem and, in some instances, upgrades performance over factory. We've done this through the all new 034 Motorsport PCV breather hose and the 034 Motorsport catch can kit. Both products do away with the factory failure prone PCV check valve system and instead utilize a 034 Motorsport design upgraded high flow check valve system. These check valves were benchmarked against the factory PCV system to ensure that they provided the adequate amount of flow, something that in our testing no other check valve solution on the market offers. In addition to matching OEM flow, they exceed the ability for boost pressure to be held, tested all the way up to and through 40 psi without any issues. The 034 Motorsport PCV breather hose acts as a direct fit replacement, allowing you to install this on any 
EA839 Audi listed in the fitment guide with zero modification necessary for installation. Simply remove the factory failure prone hose and replace it with this bulletproof lifetime upgrade. Whether you're stock or tuned, stage one, all the way to stage three, this is something that every Audi EA839 needs. For those that want to take the opportunity to remove a failure point and upgrade even further, we offer the 034 Motorsport Catch Can Kit. The Catch Can Kit exists to take PCV performance a step further and ensure that any potential oil vapors that would exit through the PCV block and normally be burned off in the intake track are instead captured and trapped to allow you to either recirculate directly back to the oil pan or drain separately. The Catch Can Kit can operate in two different ways. You can choose to empty the Catch Can whenever it is full, and you can simply check its fill by using the integrated dipstick or you can choose to install our drain back kit which connects to the bottom of the catch can and allows the captured oil vapors and pooled oil to drain right back into the oil pan and be recirculated into the oiling system. It's a common misconception that the fluids that are captured in a catch can are considered bad or need to be removed from the system. There's a lot of debate over whether that is true or incorrect. However, in our testing here, we've found that what is captured in the catch can system predominantly is oil vapor that is allowed to pool in the catch can system. This oil vapor normally would pass through with the PCV breather into the turbo inlet and be burned off in the combustion cycle, which is fine. However, that does result in potentially increased carbon buildup and oil consumption. Once captured in the catch can system, the oil vapor can simply condense and pool and return back into the oil pan via the attached drain system. We designed the kit to be used with or without the drain back system to ultimately allow for personal preference. If you decide against using the drain back system, you can simply empty the catch can by removing two bolts and pouring the contents of the catch can into a disposal system. You may be asking yourself, which kit should I choose? Should I do the PCV breather hose upgrade or do the full catch can kit? As outlined earlier, there are some advantages to running the catch can system over just the base PCV breather hose. However, in our extended testing, both systems will allow the car to run reliably for years to come. So ultimately the choice is yours. Both of these kits can now be found at 034motorsport.com as well as any 034 Motorsport authorized retailer or distributor, both in the United States and internationally. If you guys have any questions about the products that we talked about today, leave a comment in the comment section below or email us at contact at 034motorsport.com.